So this video are for people that want to pack into a new home or a new house, either they build a house or a rented apartment, and also people that want to uh, enter into a new shop for a business or for any reason. So I'm going to share with you on what, on how you can neutralize or how you can destroy every negative things that is going that is going to affect you in that place using the natural things that is very natural without side effects or any harmful all right so relax and let's go good morning to you good afternoon and good evening i'm greeting you all depend on wherever you are and exactly when you see this video you are highly welcome to my channel welcome to our channel if today is your first time or you're just stopping by to say hi you are highly welcome so please consider this place as a family by subscribing and don't forget to turn on the bell notification so you will always get notified whenever i upload a new video for my return subscribers thank you very much for coming back your presence matters a lot to me and i pray that god will bless you all right so now this video is very very important even if you are not packing into a new home or a new shop is a knowledge that you can share to your family to your friends and even have it at any time because i know that definitely you must pack into the house you build yourself all right so this recipe works for people renting a new apartment or a new shop or people that is also packing into their own house which they build on themselves this recipe is very necessary because this time around like i said a lot of things is happening in some buildings or in some areas sometimes you discover that when you pack in when you pack into a new house or a new home you start no noticing some setback you start noticing frequent sickness for your children you start noticing some negative things all right it's mostly common in uh in the town even village this time around because of we are in an evil world sometimes it can be from the person that built the house sometimes it might not be from that person it can be because of the foundation of that building remember that even the person that built that house acquired that land from somebody all right or sometimes it may be as a result of the person that packed out from that place before you self pack in so there is so many ways that is happening. That is why in most of these things, I would always advise you, don't have anybody in mind if you are not sure, if you are not 100% sure of using any of this or knowing that this person is the cause of whatever I'm passing through so that you will not go and add to your problems. All right? Now, this is what you do if you are packing into a new home or a new shop is all natural things number one thing you'll need is your cooking salt salt that you use in your kitchen that is why i told you they are all natural things so it's not evil and it's not fetish it's not diabolic this is the natural thing all right now you need salt and if you want to use this if you want to do this particular recipe don't use salt you have already been using to cook just go to the market and buy a new salt all right now when you buy this new salt another thing you need again is a new bucket buy a new bucket in the market a bucket of your choice a bucket any color of that bucket make sure you acquire a new bucket now another thing you need is camphor i'm going to show you the kind of camphor i am talking about on the screen this camphor has a lot of spiritual benefit if you have been following us all this while you will know the numerous way or many ways you can use this camphor all right it also has a lot of health benefits people use it to cook herbs all right all right like it has a lot of benefit all right now another thing you need is white detergent any detergent of your choice white color now here we go now when you are when you are about to pack into a new house i am not saying where you have already packed in if you have already packed in all right, I did a video on that. So just check other videos, check on my videos. You're going to see how to cleanse your home. That is if you're already living there, maybe you did not see the video. I am talking about people that is about to enter into a new house or a new shop. Now, this is what you will do. Now, that bucket that you buy, that comfort and that salt. All right, now, 
Go, you now you get your mob. You can buy a new mob. Mobbing stick. Now take all these items to that house. This comfort that I'm talking about is normally eight pieces in a pack. I don't know, but I'm going to show you on the screen so you will know exactly the way I'm talking about where I am. This comfort used to uh, they used to sell it 800, but now it seems it's 1,000 for the pack. So the pack contains eight comfort. Now, what you need to do is, is try to buy it two pack so that you will get eight times two. That is 16. Because I'm going to tell you what you use it for. Now, when you go to that new apartment you are about to pack in, now open that bring that bucket of water that bucket add water that you are going to use to mop that place and also don't forget please buy a new broom a new broom as well our local broom i'm not talking about this english broom now i'm going to also show you on the screen now when you get all these items now that bucket add water into it okay when you add water into it that salt that you have the new one you buy open it use your hand be taking it one two three four five that is seven times all right that is seven pinch let me tell you maybe on the next video or one of my videos i'm going to explain to you the the spiritual meaning of numbers number seven number nine all right and number five they has meaning because you cannot share them so we used to think that you don't share anything that is, but on the next video, maybe I'm going to explain more about it. So this particular one, you're taking the seven pinch of salt out of that new salt and put it inside that bucket. You have added your water. Now that come for use seven pieces, grind it into powdered form and put it inside that bucket. Then add your white detergent. Like I said, you are going to buy a new bucket and a new mop and a new broom. Now, this is what you do. First of all, use that broom that you buy and use it to start sweeping that uh, house or that shop. Start sweeping every, if it's two bedroom, for example, you are going to sweep all of them. Then after you have sweep it, you use something and pack it. You make sure you pack those, uh, the whether there is dirty, whether it's not dirty. Make sure each of the places that you sweep, let's assume you sweep the parlor, make sure you pack it at the center of that parlor. When you, when you are into that house, you will know where the center is. So make sure you pack it at the center of that parlor. That is how you do to other rooms. Then after you've done that, Pack those things, either sand, either dirty that you have swept from the place. Pack it very well. All right? Now, keep it. I'm going to tell you what you are going to do with it. Okay, now, that water you have mixed all these things, start using it to mop that places. As you are mopping it, don't forget to be praying. That as you are mopping this thing, you are mopping out, mopping out every negativity in this home. Anything that will bring dryness in this house or in this job. Whatever that will make you to come here with many properties and go empty-handed. Everything. So I don't need to tell you what exactly you want to pray. But you are praying out everything that you don't want to be seeing in that house. That is exactly what you are praying. Then, after that, you've done mobbing it, all right? Now, what you need to do is this. You can dispose the water, dispose the... You can dispose the water and dispose the... The, the water, yes, the water. Now, for that bucket, for that mob and for that broom, you can still use it. You can keep it there. When you pack there, you keep using it. That is if you want. It's optional. It does not have any negative effect. So if you feel your spirit tells you, oh yeah, when I pack here, I want to start using it because it's new, good and fine. If you don't want to use it, it's left for you. So this one now is between you and your spirit. But like I said, it has no meaning. Now, after mobbing it, remember I tell you to buy uh, the pack, the comfort pack, so that you get a, 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 a two times nine, that is 18 pieces. Now, when you are done mobbing it, that comfort that you buy are the four edges of that house, four corners of the building. Drop one, one comfort there, drop one here, drop one here, drop one here, drop one here. This is how you do it in each of the house let's assume it's a two bedroom so you buy the one that you know that will be okay for you to put it in each of the four corners 
of that house. Then after putting it there, okay, you are done. Then close that apartment for seven days before you go back to start living there. Or that shop for seven days before you go back to start using that shop. I mean seven days if you have not pack into the house if you have packed into the house already like i said i did a video on that just check the video how to cleanse your house for negativity and all of that so i'm just talking for new people now for that thing that you sweep out from that house i don't know like i said it can be dirty it can be sand but remember i told you to make sure you pack it at the center of that place and as you're sweeping it you're going to be pretty that's you're sweeping whatever all this like the way you are mobbing it what you have prayed when mobbing it now pack it when you are going out when you are going back to your base all right or just go far place from that place that uh where your house or your shop is i'm not saying you should go to london no but make sure you go a little bit far and you throw those things away and you say that you are throwing this thing away that is how you are throwing all these things you have packed out of this house away that it will not manifest in your home all right now like i said close that house close that shop sorry guys the video interrupted so now like i said close that shop close that house okay for seven days before you go back to start living there Please don't take it for granted. And like I used to tell you, all these things we are saying here is a natural thing. Salt is something that we use in cooking. So what salt represents physically, spiritually, that is what it represents. It brings taste. It wear away evil. It removes negativities. Careful, like I said, it has a health benefit. Like mostly in Yoruba land, they mainly use it to cook all this agbo, all this, so I'm just telling you, so for you to see that it's something that is eatable, all right? So now, what again, water, you know what water is all about. So it's just natural thing. But why I am always sounding it like this is that, you know, some people, the everything to them is evil. Everything to them is diabolic. So if you think that any of the recipe that I said here is evil to you, just keep to it. Or better unsubscribe so you will stop seeing all those things i don't want you to go against your belief but all i am sharing with you is something that when you do it you are having a lot of testimony if you want to hear about testimony go through the comment section by the grace of god you are going to see the natural the the natural testimonies of people by using natural things all right it's very very effective when you use it in a right way so this is another way you can cleanse out or remove evil from the new house or new shop you want to enter. And believe me, all your desires in that place will be manifesting. Thank you for watching. If you love this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and cheer. And see you in my next video. Stay blessed. Bye.